Everything has lost its taste. 
All right, guys, are we about ready to roll? We've got Dhruv, the basic builder. <laughs> We've got uh, Smash the Trash. Cool, cool. Make sure I've got everything set up here. I think I've got us some good... I think I've got us some good copyright-free Christmas music, I think. It's kind of like a little mix of instrumental and <laughs> get us a little bit of a Christmas spirit, right, while we build? Guys, if you didn't get to catch this last night, this is our like little Santa's cottage, Santa's house type build. So I thought this would be cool. This is our little teddy bear bicycle you know like kind of like Santa's attic little extra storage up there here's his front little doorway I've got the big polar bear statue got this really cool fireplace off the workshop it's like the little living room area we're using bolds sleigh we're gonna try to extend that garage just a little bit though And let's just go ahead and let's just try to get started. Why not? We've got a lot to do. You guys were even saying last night it'd be cool if we would um, uh, maybe just start a little village, you know, for these next couple streams, kind of leading up to Christmas, you know? We could do as a little village. I think that'd be cool. But first things first, we've got to uh, extend this garage. Is that a little loud in your all's ear? Should I turn that down a hair? How do you think that... How's the music compared to my voice? do 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 All right, let's move Bold Sled over just a hair. We'll raise it. Now there's a little more room. Look, I put a little bulb out here for Rudolph. Ding, ding. So they can get the presents delivered to the little children. <laughs> Okay, so we've got the garage extended. Uh oh, Drew was rude off the other day. <laughs> Little red sore nose. Let's see here. This is the roof piece I've typically been using here. Okay, we've got the the sleigh garage <laughs> a little extended now, so you know. Now it's just all about kind of almost like detailing it up, you know. We need some we need some detail. Do, 
I want those flat little stone pieces. <laughs> yeah, Drew's got a little more like jazz to his, doesn't it? It's like do 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 do. <laughs> I was really focused on this build last night. So if I go quiet, even Linda was like, "S Dan, are you still here?" <laughs> Sometimes when you get concentrating on these builds, you just kind of you can go a little quiet. As long as you all see the mouse moving, <laughs> I, am, I am typically, I'm still right here with you. I'm just focusing. <laughs> yeah, got to stay in the zone. I shall steal you for a moment. You know what we should start next, I was thinking? I've already been looking up some concept art. We should start a little Christmas inn. Like a, you know, like a little Christmas type hotel deal. Because I was thinking, even coming down through here, because remember, this was going to be like just a regular cabin. But we could even put like, what would be a good path? Like, where's the... Not like a, well, almost like a, well, we could even do like a brick path. And just make this, just kind of weave in and out through the streets, you know? We could put up lanterns. Let's see if I can come this way and like turn around the... And see, like, maybe across the road over here, we could do the Christmas Inn, like over here. Sometimes you just got to break, even like, you know, it, even if it helps take a break from the Santa facade over here, it helps sometimes. We want a warmer glow than that, though. We want like the, yeah. Yeah. I don't know if these would look better or the actual classic, the classic lamp post looks more Christmas village like, doesn't it though? Yeah, or the three broomsticks. Hey, Holly. Nah, you are right on time, my friend. We're just kind of jumping in and getting started on this. We're thinking about doing a little, like a Christmas village, Holly, instead of just ending with the, uh, with Santa's cabin, because, I mean, we're only on the 19th. Drove said you could make hogshed in this.
We could do like a little fence here in Santa's kind of, this is like Santa's village shop, <laughs> we could call it. Hogsmead. That'd be an interesting project. Let me just see how this fence would look. Kind of fencing off the little cabin here. I know I said it last night, but I love how they've, like Frontier, nailed the weather mechanic on this, didn't they? Like just how the snow sits on everything. That'd be a cool little village piece right here, wouldn't it? Like a little everybody just coming through the streets and we got to get them some, we got to get, we got to get some lights on that though, you know? This looks like a, a cozy little cabin. Hey, thank you, Holly. And Holly, don't you think it's neat sometimes too, like how we're going back and creating actual videos of the builds? Um, I'm trying to just so people that can't catch the live stream can get like a quick breakdown. You know, people that don't have time to sit and watch the live stream. I think that's working out really good for just regular video people. I was like, yeah, it's it. I was at Lowe's buying house stuff. <laughs> yeah, Seth, can you hear me? Mic check. <laughs> I am still here. Can you all hear me? Mic check, mic check. Can you hear me, Holly? You know, that might get a little too weird with the sidewalk or I don't, it might, I don't know if that'll look right. So I might just leave it just the end game path. Holly, if you're out here on these little benches, you are cold right now.
Hey, little Punky's down here. What are you doing, Punky? Hey. Pumpkin has come downstairs. <laughs> okay, Pumpkin's going to join us for the uh, <laughs> for the Christmas build, I guess. What you doing, Punky? Won't finish that off yet, but kind of just give you the idea of like a, almost like a little corral. <laughs> yep, Totter, she is a little tiny like wiener dog Jack, Mus Jack Russell mix. Hey, Punky, they're talking about you over here. She doesn't come down here too much, so she's exploring. Sometimes you can hear, like, if she barks during the stream, people are like, is that pumpkin? <laughs> and you know what, Holly? With this being on a street now, kind of out here, it would make more sense that, the, that we've got, like, some, some, like, light decorations. So let's go ahead and try that. I just kind of want to see. Not very big, are they? I mean, those are the big ones, but... I wonder if we should... Ah, oh, see, so you can't, like, interchange the lights. They're either white or that's it. still kind of cool though. It's a little subtle, isn't it? Yes, that was important for this build to make sure we had the light protruding from the building. I mean, that's kind of going to be the stick of kind of all of this. All of these little these little builds will do in this. Dero, dero, dero. need like a I like the star but maybe we need like a little wreath up here on the chimney too hmm Hey, what's up, Primal? I don't know what my favorite animal is. It would probably be a manatee if they'd give us one. <laughs> I just want a manatee to build like a big waterfall-filled lagoon for.
Oh yeah, the wolves are cool. You know, I wonder, you know what one piece we could add? I wonder what my, like, fairy tale house would look like over here. We might as well see while we're in here. I've got this, I've got this cottage too that would be a cool piece here. Remember this cottage I did? We'll just have to, like, Christmas, Christmas it up. <laughs> Christmas fi it. Like a little Christmas cottage. Put some lights and stuff on it and some stars. Be a good little piece. Got the TV going in here. <laughs> I built this a long time ago. Or could maybe even add it to the... Remember how I was saying we needed to finish the side over here? Could even add it to the... To this main cottage. Just get rid of the Jeep. <laughs> My profile picture is just a picture of an otter with a Christmas hat. You know, Holly, I think that may work. And what I'll do is I will take one of these to make, really make it glow over here as well. They did do a wonderful job on those elephants, we have to admit. The only thing is the roof, this little roof and stuff kind of sticks through here. Kind of sticks through just a little bit, doesn't it? That little Jeep would be fun to start, wouldn't it? <laughs> Out here in all this. I wish the reindeer all had different racks instead of pre-made ones. <laughs> yeah. So this is kind of went from... Uh... This is like Santa's compound now, isn't it? <laughs> it's like a whole deal. Still cool, though. Oh, wait. You know what? We need a tree over there, too.
Would a couple out here in the yard look good? Kind of like just like they've got little lit trees up here. Looks kind of cool, doesn't it? Just, you know, don't overdo it, but... <laughs> Let's put a little tree in front of the window. People can see that tree from outside. These branches are kind of protecting that tree a little. That's cute. Punky, please don't eat my shoe. Uh-oh, hold on a second. <laughs> Had, sorry, had to do a had to do a pumpkin shoe check. <laughs> she is in that teething phase, so she will she will eat any she will try to eat any shoe you you leave lying around. <laughs> She's a good girl though. Kind of just want us a couple little trees just over off that back edge, kind of to help fill this corner a little bit. Ding, 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 ding. I don't know what this little pole could be, but I kind of just like it there. It does like it can it can stay. Y'all, this is coming out pretty stinking cool, isn't it? I told you all, you just you, you have to stick with me. It could it looks like poo at the beginning, but if you if I can just run through enough of these ideas, we can make it we can make it work. Hey, Micah, what's up? What's up, Jake? Dun, dun, dun.
Tun, tun, tun. Spicy beans, what's up? Your username just makes me happy. <laughs> Spicy beans. Dun, 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 dun. This was a good idea with the Christmas music. That was cool. There, see how it ended up working out pretty good um, as far as the uh, raising the, the cottage a little bit above the street level like we did early on. I think that looks a lot better. Hey, what's up, critters? You know, I don't know. We could put, we could do penguins. Kind of right now we're going for the, uh, the, uh, just a Christmas village vibe. Hey, Kyron, what's up, buddy? Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> the creepy panda is still here. Isn't the creepy panda wonderful, though? In a creepy way. <laughs> Brilliant, but scary. <laughs> In the I was telling people though, remember last night in the daytime? Okay, like right now, yes, up there, kind of creepy, like hiding out in the attic. But in the daytime, he turns like not too bad. See, in the daytime, he's all like, yay. <laughs> it's just it. At night, he turns on us a little, a little bit. But that's okay. He's just, he's just creepy bear. <laughs> what are you going to do? Got to get over here working on that garage some, too, you know? The 
This place just really comes to life at night. Hmm. If I could steal this, I need a little bit of... Cover this up over here, don't I? See if I can dress this up just a hair with this log piece. Kind of hide this trim. That works out okay. There we go, and that hides that decent, so that worked out okay. Probably want to do it over here, too, though. Line to surface, please. There we go. Just kind of cleans up those edges, you know? A little bit. Yeah, I got that fireplace off the workshop. It's actually massive. Like, we had to cut the top of it off to get it to fit in the house. It was pretty large. Headless fireplace, yes. There we go, it dresses that walkway up pretty decent. Hmm. 
There we go. That gives that. That window needed something. It was just like a little too much glass, wasn't it? That kind of cozies that up pretty good. Creepy Panda in the Headless Fireplace. That works. Well, a lot of people are going to look forward to this new year, aren't they? Ushering 2020 out of here. It's like one of those weird deals where... You know, like some people say like, oh, I don't really care about the New Year's. It's really not that big of a deal. <laughs> I think this year, since with all that's happened, this is absolutely going to be one of those times where either, even the people that don't typically care about New Year's are probably going to be like, yes, please. <laughs> please. I don't even usually stay up for the... Um, for New Year's and all that, but I think I may even stay up this year <laughs> just so I can watch 2020 go. Dun, dun, dun. You know what, maybe I won't fence this up just yet. Pumpkin's laying in front of the heater. Uh, I think I'm going to go, hold on, I'm going to go grab her a blanket real quick. She's laying in front of the heater.
There we go. Now she's got a little blanky. I was eyeballing one of those electric heaters in Lowe's. My dogs would love it. Oh, yeah, she loves it. See, down here, kind of like where the game room is, it's like, it's below ground. It's like halfway below ground. And it is super cold down here in the winter time. And I got one of those little, like little tower heaters from um, Lowe's that like oscillates. And when she's down here, she loves it. She lays in front of it. That's a good girl, Punky. You're a good girl. All right, Punky is going to lay here and watch the stream. I thought she'd jet back upstairs. <laughs> I got my dog a heated igloo for when he goes outside. That's cool. <laughs> Manual, I was not too sure about this like yesterday evening, like halfway through, but sometimes I even have to tell myself, just give it some time and you can make it happen. The lighting in this game though, right? It is just killer. Like no way this, t I mean, you could it you could do it halfway like this with um with Planet Coaster but not this type of glow. It's just it's not happening. Um but with this it's just awesome. You know what, now let's just go, just for giggles again, let me go to the workshop and I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna type in Christmas and see if anything comes up like I think I could boost the street up a little bit with. Let's just see what some of these people have done. Daryl, Daryl, Daryl. Somebody's did some really cool Christmas garland. Have you all seen that like detailed penguin ice cathedral that's on the workshop? That's incredible. There's the little Santa. Little snowman guy. I wonder if we could make it. We could. I wonder if. Let's try. Like. I wonder if we could make a little snowman here. Like maybe out of the art shapes, possibly. I didn't think about that. A little snowman. <laughs> Bold, my little goofball is here. Bold contributes more to these builds, like Bold and Holly, just by random comments than like anyone I've ever had on the channel. <laughs> Bold and Holly can just change the whole direction of kind of what we're doing <laughs> in a good way. All right, rounded shapes. Two round. 
little too big, a little too small. Just right. Well, I don't want to repeat though and have like a creepy. You guys make fun of the snowman though. <laughs> we got a, can't have a creepy snowman and a creepy uh creepy panda. <laughs> Night scare before Christmas. Daryl, Daryl, Daryl. Pumpkin sounded like she was ripping the carpet up underneath the pool table. May have to take her back upstairs. <laughs> she was laying there all sweet and quiet. Nation Christmas card? Yeah, I'm gonna have to take her back upstairs. I think she's trying to eat the carpet, eat the rug.
There we go. Yeah, Drew, we've kind of got a little puppy here, so you you can feel free to jet on um, if you don't have a couple seconds to wait. Appreciate it. Okay, let's see. Kind of not, I'm just not liking this regular little dark corner over here. There we go, that'll work. Yeah, we'll get this on the workshop whenever we wrap this up. What is it bold? The elephant time place? The little, um, kind of in the concept art I was looking at yesterday, this is actually a little clock. Do we have any good little clocks that may hey we've got we've got some I just are they I wonder if they're too big though oh no that one's not too big oh yeah the elephant time lapse that was yeah that was fun I just thought you know like for anybody because that was like the longest live stream we've done. I thought that would be cool to let people kind of see the process behind that, you know? I thought that was pretty cool too.
I think I like the white one better. Kind of pops a little more here, the that dark gray clock. Is not enough. And it still kind of doubles as a light, so. Holly's like, I was there and I watched the video. That's what um, I think Spicy Beans commented this morning. Spicy's like, hey, I was there. <laughs> that was funny. Can this be my snowman's little hat? Too bad I couldn't paint that black. It's like a little snowman cap. Small little light. He kind of looks like a alien ant snowman <laughs> with those eyes it will leave him faceless There we go, those arms look a little less creepy. <laughs> ding, da, ding, da, ding. Oh wait, the music went to an ad. There we go. Well, Werble, you're a tad late, but not too terrible. <laughs> I think Holly was saying some lights up here may may help this corner a little bit. I think I agree. I think I agree.
<laughs> Poison Blade, what's up, buddy? Poison Blade, we are channeling our um we are channeling our Christmas village vibes here. This is like a Santa's village workshop kind of like staging area for the reindeer. This is bold sled. Isn't this a cozy little living room area? Get lights on that up there too, eventually. Now, Poison Blade, you gotta work out. <laughs> Don't be putting that off. Everybody at work on the on the first wants to start a like a weight loss challenge. So we'll see how that goes. Is the chimney supposed to be leaning to the right? No. <laughs> But it is, isn't it? That was a good eye on that. <laughs> nah, Mast, we're in here for a little bit. We're building like a little Christmas village thing. <laughs> Santa's workshop slash Christmas Inn here in a minute, maybe. <laughs> I said, yeah, me too, as I reach for my chocolate. Same. Ah! 
Hey, that's what Bold said to do. She said, hey, snap a pic of that and you should turn that into the Bro Nation greeting card co-op. <laughs> she just said that like five minutes ago. So I'm thinking maybe to start the the inn over here, kind of across the street from the cabin. You know? Let me show you all. It's like a it's like a Lemax inn. Let me see if I can hold on, I'm gonna try to find a picture real quick. Because I have the piece in real life. Like, I should just go upstairs. It, it's plugged up. I should just go upstairs and get it and bring it down here and just look at it like as a reference right in front of me. <laughs> but, lazy. Let me see if I can find this thing. We've got, in, like, just infinite amount of Lemax little, little houses and stuff to go off of. But let me see if I can find you all the one that I actually have. I don't see it right off top. A bunch of really cool ones though. Little Christmas breakfast, lunch, and dinner one. Where is this little fella? Let me just, maybe it's not Lee Max. Let me just type in Christmas Village Inn. Where are you? It's just kind of, it's kind of, it's a, it's taller than it is wide. It's like a really little subtle Christmas Inn. But I do not. Hmm. I absolutely do not see that Shakespeare in is kind of like what I'm talking about, but it's not it's not the piece that I have. I'll get y'all a picture of this real quick though, because this is kind of what it looks like, but not one hundred percent what I have upstairs. Let me show y'all this a sec. This is This is kind of what we're going for. Let's see. Kind of something like this. See how it's got the upper level? It's got like the stone bottom, the little upper level with all the glowing and the, and the trees. Like I think we could do that across the street. Matt said I had a big holiday. I had big plans to make a nice holiday zoo build. <laughs> Drew said howdy partners. So you guys think we could make that happen across the street? Well, you all look at that. Let me just look. Let me just look for one more moment for that for my piece. Can't believe I don't see it. It's, I mean, these pieces aren't like that exclusive. Maybe that inn I have is just old. Hmm. 
do not see it. Oh well. We can kind of go with that. I might, just, I might actually like take a pick upstairs of next time I'm up there. And um, I will show you all on the next stream. <laughs> hey, Eben, what's up, buddy? We are building a Christmas village with our, how many days till Christmas? Like six? Six days till Christmas, I think. So actually, let me get over here on my, I'll pull my, I'll pull a mass bandit over here on my <laughs> other screen. And see if I can get to work on this. Okay, so we're definitely going to have to start with the rock work first. Hold on, let me make this a little bigger. Dun -dun 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 -dun. I'm putting the finishing touches on my Sienna build. <laughs> yeah, Bolt said, is this your crazy antiques roadshow moment where you find out you have some crazy rare in? <laughs> Six days to Christmas. Hello, Deegan. Do you all like just text each other at the same time when you get up? Everybody's like rolling in here at the same time. <laughs> Okay, one thing this little piece calls for is a very steep little <laughs> set of stairs. So that's probably what we need to do first. It's got a really creepy little steep set of stairs. Please tell me you spent a week building an extremely intricate and detailed warthog habitat. <laughs> This should be good. This should be good length. Like I said, this is pretty, pretty steeped and pronounced here. Which is typically the Lemax way. <laughs> It wouldn't even take Masked Bandit any beers to fall down these stairs. He could be, he could be completely straight and still fall down these. Okay, I think that's steep enough. How many does this even count? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I can see ten in the picture. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hmm. Let's stay consistent with what we're trying to emulate here. Nine. A ten. <laughs> Stairs are the best. I 
Mask, did uh, Drew mention he actually has glasses now? <laughs> so he can see us again. Poor old Drew. Old Drew, our blind little buddy. Hmm. This actually, actually has, <laughs> Nigel Thornberry, this actually has a little archway over it that we may have to customize. We may have to customize this, my friends. Because the stairs aren't, they're not, they're just kind of not open to the street. They're more closed off. Maybe we can achieve this with the going back to South America. Or did I use any of that over here? Yes, I used it right here. Okay. Try to use our good old friend Align to Surface. I started that off way creepy. Maybe I'm drunk. <laughs> Uh oh, Savannah, overslept. Christmas time has come again. 
Honestly, I'm like a 4th of July, middle of summer type person. Like pretty much once Christmas is over, I'm ready for winter to just be gone. <laughs> Savannah, nope, got the weekend off. Me too. Okay, so then you've got the stairs. We've got this kind of off. Let's try to get some light in here just to start. And then we have another open archway that will kind of go through here that I think one of you all said could kind of take us to like maybe a little park or a little marketplace. You know? Hey, Plastic Swans, what's up? Check out the little Christmas house now. Come out pretty cool, didn't it? Look, we give it a little front yard and some trees. Added a lot more lights. We uh, extended the garage here to fit Bold Sleigh. We've got Rudolph a nose. <laughs> And I added in my little cabin over here, kind of like the back side. They're in here like watching a panda show. <laughs> Somebody's Jeep's down here that's going to be really tough to start probably in all this freezing cold and snow. <laughs> Now we've moved over to this little, like, inn. Let's see how these would look. Looks kind of hotel-like, those little aquatic lamps we have now. Then they actually, the concept art, or the little piece actually has a another little light above the stairs here. Oh, Drew, just get out of here now. Go on, get. <laughs> Fine. Bye!
Joakim. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to our Christmas village. <laughs> let's see, does that, do the, I don't even know if the stone piece, let's just see, do I have an archway for that? We do, okay. Let me see, I think I have a flat block here. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, yeah. Also going to need some light going through there, some pretty decent light. Let's bring out this big guy again. This guy's like the, the light king. There we go, we can kind of hide him pretty nice up in there. Oh, I just stream with uh, with OBS critters abroad. OBS for the win. OBS. Whoops, got a little grass sticking up back there. Um, you know, they'd be cool if we had some, like if we had billboards, I could bring in like some custom, like Christmas, uh, I could bring in some custom Christmas posters. But without billboards, there's not really, you know, I'm kind of... Without billboards, I'm a little hemmed up with that idea, aren't I? <laughs> that is not happening. Unfortunately.
I do really hope we can get custom boards and sound in some time. Yep, me too. And then so the top, the actual top deck of all of this is mostly plaster and wood, it looks like. Like a tan. Can we change the color of the, of like the plaster wall set in this? There's limestone. Even that, I can't change the color of the limestone. Not metal. You can ch okay. You can change the color of the mud, but there is like I don't want that weird design on it. That's just weird. Like the the choices that you can change and can't. Painted brick. There's plaster. Okay, so we can change plaster at least. And what do we have? We actually need a. Hmm, this may be a little weird because I don't have like those half pieces. See, if I could turn this on its axis and just kind of... On its axis and just flip it, that would work perfect. Hey, Leaf, what's up, buddy? Yeah, we're doing like a little Christmas village inn over here. But see, here's how the house turned out so far. Oh, well, the shop slash house. <laughs> Still got some work to do back here, but you get the idea. It's coming along. It's kind of like the Santa compound. <laughs> hey, there's Claire. Claire, we moved on to the, uh, we moved on to a Christmas Inn to kind of complement the Santa's little workshop cabin. Isn't that cool? Like I'm just kind of decided to do a little town out of it for the next few days since we're messing with the in the Christmas area over here. Okay, there are some little pieces that I remember seeing somewhere that I think would work really well for this little balcony thing that I see in the piece of art. I've got to start uh, I've got to start favoriting these designs when I see them. Wasn't the pallets? I don't think it was in wall decorations, but it could be. Oh, yeah, here it is. Yeah, these Australian planks. And let's see how many of these go across. It's kind of like. Before the building turns, there's like four of them. So one, two, three, four. Then it splits with a big support beam that we'll put in, and then it goes four again. One, two, three, four. 
three, four. Oh, I didn't know you could favor blueprints either. <laughs> That's cool. Okay, definitely has those support beams like that. This little area is actually its own, it's like a window kind of butts up against this. Could see what this looks like in the daytime. Watch your eyes a second. <laughs> Whoop, the snowman is ice. The snowman is a massive ball of ice. Typically, I guess that's a neat thing, but in this case, we don't, we don't want it like aqua blue. Let's see. Now the fire is still rolling. Probably going to need another glass piece right here, I'd say. Another glass wall piece. So we can shine some light through this, but I need like a tiny piece. Do we have like any little, just tiny pieces of free? Oh, here we go, yes. The window is kind of tiny in this picture I'm going off of. So this could work and then I just need to kind of frame it up.
And what is on the other side? Okay, so there's actually... This is actually a little high because there's a balcony that kind of goes over the stairs. So that kind of needs to come down. Get rid of that one. Bring this down. Bring this down and forward a hair. See, now by doing this actual window, we'll be able to get a good glow from up there, too. Like a good upstairs glow. And let me get some floor in up here. Yes, would not be an s stand build without a balcony, right? <laughs> we'll use this stained floor, but it'll be it'll be okay because this will be covered. This will be covered. Kind of looks like in the concept art, I think what they're insinuating is these stairs would lead up to this top balcony. <clears throat> hey, Merry Christmas, Carmen. Thank you for stopping by. You know, I may be able to frame this window up with a door. Then we'll go back to nighttime and just see how it kind of, see how we can make it glow. And then back on this balcony, there actually is a door. See, it's like Planet Zoo doors, though. They're like, seems like they're extremely, extremely tiny or they're massively, unnecessarily large. It's kind of like they're, I don't know, it's just, it just seems weird to me. And then there are another set of windows up on this balcony. So I guess this could, you know, this could probably be like a cool little bedroom, like a little lookout or maybe even like a little reading nook. This piece will have a roof over it as well. All right, Bolt, we'll see you later.
And I still think we can steal this little trick from over at the regular house and put this along the bottom. Just ri just whoops, just really kind of gives these windows more character with this kind of like framing. See how it kind of like stops the just breaks it up really neat. <laughs> Give this balcony just a little bit of a of a railing. African grasslands? Well, you never know what we'll get into, possibly. You never know. Old Drew! Yeah, we'll dip out of here in a minute and probably go pick on Drew. We got a pretty good bit done. We wish you a Merry Christmas! Does that look right? Yeah, that's kind of how this goes. Except for there's a whole big section over there we'll have to get to, too. And we've got to come up... This, this build has some dormers as well. So we will have to do some dormers. Ah, there's Heather! <laughs> Ha ha ha! 
You just cannot trust YouTube, can we, Heather? <laughs> you just never know. <laughs> Steal this little guy. Check it out, Heather. Look, we've got, we added a bunch of lights, a little front yard to the little house. Thank you. Ooh, that looks kind of cool having that like a little split. All right, let's get some light up here too. Close this little corner off one second, though. There we go, Heather. See how it kind of, that light gives off a cool glow from inside of the windows? Kind of do the same thing from back here. There we go. Thank you, Claire. I thought you guys would like this. Like I said we'll have to keep it going this week. Just try to try to keep some different ideas flowing and see what we can make happen. <laughs> As Stan Kincaid. You know, the one thing is, too, we're going to have to come up with some kind of little... 
Hmm. Ha <laughs> ha! have to come up with some kind of little... Dormer situation. I wonder... See, that little guy's just kind of not quite big enough. Too big. Too big. Too big. Hmm. May just have to. May just have to do it custom again. May have to do it custom. But anyways, guys, yeah, we'll go ahead and wrap this up for today. Maybe do a little, um, here in a little bit, I might record just a standalone video of this and some cinematics for the people that haven't caught the live stream the last couple nights. We'll get that out. And then... Um, Probably I'm trying to think about tomorrow. I can't remember. I don't think I have anything weird going on, but I uh, nonetheless will try to get on here and kind of get something rolling. But yes, let's go ahead. I will give me a moment to get this outro rolling, and everyone can say their goodbyes, and then we will. We can jump on over and bug Drew and we'll come back tomorrow and try to try to get a little more done on this. And I might get some more done later on this evening. I don't know if I'll stream it, but at least get it in here and get it a little cleaned up and looking decent. <laughs> hey, thank you guys. And did I save this yet? I think I just did. Yes, we did. Just in case. Yeah, so let's um, let's go ahead. We'll jump on out of here. And let me get our little outro. Let me get our little outro put on here. I like this new outro, Heather. Like the five minute countdown. Because everybody can like tell each other bye. And you know. <laughs> I think it's just cool. But anyways, guys, yes, I will catch you next time. Thank you.
Everything is great inside this narrow